Hey there, got a quick Webflow hack for you if you ever have a situation where you need to override the styling on a symbol for just a specific page or two. So in this example right here, I have an about page and what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the nav bar into a symbol and I'm going to have it where the current nav link is full 100% opacity and all the other ones are grayed out. Now to ensure that you see it, and I'm really going to exaggerate it, so I'm going to turn the opacity on the other nav links to like 10 or 20%. And we'll go from there. So I'm going to turn the nav bar into a symbol. And I'm going to call it nav. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the nav links. And I'm going to turn down the opacity to about 10. And the current nav link, which is about, is going to retain its full 100% opacity. Now, let's say you're in a situation where your home page doesn't have any of these nav links and you want the home page to have all of them be 100% opacity. What you can do is you're going to go to the home page and what we're going to do is we're going to first add in the symbol. So we're going to drop in our nav symbol and we're going to delete the other one. And now what we're going to do is we're going to add in an HTML embed and override the styling with CSS. So I'm going to drop in an embed. And in that embed, I'm going to add my CSS. So I'm targeting the nav link because that's what I named my CSS class. And I'm going to put the color as 222. And you can use HSLA or RGB because it's going to be full 100% opacity in the situation. And I'm going to save and close. And it changes it. So there you go. Hope this helps if you're in a situation like this. Thanks for watching. Take care.